to work with some energy tonight focused on helping us to disentangle from any stories that we have around our body and our body image. One of the themes of June is this idea of letting go of any blockages that we have to fully loving ourselves um, from a body standpoint. And so much of what we have carried in our lifetimes related to our body is outside programming that has come from those around us, from society, from what we've seen as societal norms. And that often keeps us from being able to drop into the body and come into a place of deep confidence and feel secure in our physical form. And so the energies this month are asking us to look at anywhere where we're carrying those stories and begin to let go of them. Begin to unwind from anything that we've been telling ourselves that is um, really not true about our physical form. That's everything from disease patterns and maybe genetic predispositions that we may be inclined to adopt here in this physical form because of our genetic heritage, all the way up to the understanding that our body is a sacred vessel that is beautiful no matter what shape or size it is. And so in this journey that I'm about to take you on, I want you to focus on that connection, that relationship with your body. And we're going to go subtly through the energy field and begin to unplug you from any structures or programming that may exist in this physical form that may keep you from being in that place of self-love. And a lot of this energy will likely be in the lower chakras as the lower chakras are those energy centers that control our physical manifestation especially that root chakra, that's where we hold a lot of this programming. And so as you get settled in here, find a comfortable position to be in for the next little bit. I'm not sure how long this will be, but probably at least 20, if not 30 minutes long. And as you drop in, um, just begin to take some deep breaths. Imagining that the crown of your head can open up and light can begin to pour in from above the crown of the head all the way down through the body as you breathe in. Drawing that breath in really deeply, allowing the light to pass from above the crown all the way down through the body. As you exhale, pushing that energy from your heart space and, and using that breath to propel that energy and that source light all the way down into the center of the planet, opening a connection between you and the earth. And really feel that rooted connection between you and the earth here. Really drop in and feel Mother Earth holding you. Mother Nature has such a beautiful template for what it looks like for us to love our body. Nature does not apologize for blooming. Nature does not apologize for shedding its leaves and for transforming. It just is. It just has a natural evolution and shift and change and transformation that happens from season to season. And our bodies are cyclical just like that. And so as you drop into the earth, feel that connection with the cycles of the earth allowing that to activate some deep consciousness within you that says that the body is fully supported because it is connected to Mother Gaia. And as you breathe into that connection, allow your roots to go deep, deep down into the earth. And as those roots go deep down into the earth, imagine that as that connection is made between you and the center of the planet, that you're already beginning to release some of this programming some of this lack of trust in the body, some of this negative self-talk, this inner critic energy that the body holds. And as that unwinds from your being, allowing more light to pour in in its place. And we're going to twofold breathe in light here. We're going to breathe light from above the crown, from source, all the way down through the body. But we're also going to breathe back in light, renewed energy, healed energy from Mother Gaia. And so as you bring your next breath in, pull that energy, that grounded, beautiful, nurturing energy from Mother Gaia up into your heart space, hold it in the heart space for a moment, and then exhale that energy out the crown of your head. 
And so I always start my activations here with the center channel breath because it opens the pathway between heaven and earth. It gives us a bi-directional flow that allows us to release energy, not only to the earth, but also to source. And when this energy flow isn't open, when the center channel isn't open, we get things like anxiety, we get things like disease in the body. And so just allow the breath here. And as I start to bring sound and vocal toning in in a moment, just allow the sound to envelop you. Allow it to weave its way into your field. Every sound that I make has a purpose. Every bit of vibratory energy that comes through is purposeful. And if at any point there's a bit of my vocal that goes out of tune, that is an energy clearing. That is where we've hit a tight spot in the energy field and something needs to be released. And so just allow, just allow this process to Gently unfold and release anything that is is held within your being that's ready to be released. And perhaps since this is a journey to heal our connection to our body, to heal our relationship with our body, to heal our image of our body, allow that to anchor as an intention as you drop into your heart. There may be memories or things that come forward as we move through this journey from your past where you have been taunted or made fun of about your body. Allow that to be unwound here too. If there's grief that comes up, just allow. Whatever comes forward is perfect. And so as you get comfortable here, either seated or lying down, just continuing with that center channel breath throughout the process, breathing in deeply, breathing out deeply, maybe evening out your inhales and exhales. If you'd like to amplify the energy flow, you can just skip the pause between the breath. Just keep moving through a continuous flowing breath and that will get a lot of oxygen flowing in your body and that will help this process along. So one more big inhale here in through the nose and out through the mouth. Let's do that again. That feels really good. Breathing in. And I'm going to start with the tones. Sisters, Kayo, Nahu Kano, Nio, Mano Sana, Iao, our star brothers and sisters.
power of the earth. Calling in source. Calling on your body now, the body consciousness. Bring in the power. Dropping, dropping any story here. Ahe ho tahe, letting go. Ako tahe na e o, o ma e ano. Letting go of fear. Ahe ho ta, hato 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 kan no sato e. Anger. Anger towards society for programming us. Setting a boundary. Letting the anger disperse. Bringing in the strength. Feeling into the deep heartache. Nato sano. Sano 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 ye go tahe yo bringing in unconditional love. Mani, I love my body. Aho dani ako ho he ya he. I accept my body. Ato he yo ha he ha no. My body ako he. My body is yeah, 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 source. Mate ho ta he ho mane. My body is a he light. Mate ho ta he yo. I love my body. Yeah, yeah, oh. My body, oh, the vessel of light. A he ho pa. My body is a yato hana he strong gato My body is yeah 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 hum pato maka strong My body I love my body Oh my body Calling out to my body. I love you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah.
Echo, we love you, Echo. I am my body. I love my body. Allowing here in this moment the unconditional love to pour into your being. Singing softly this vibratory hum into the body. Allowing the body to be held and nurtured and supported. My body. Bringing it in. Feeling that unconditional love that release that freedom that liberation in your root chakra in your base of your spine this place of subconscious body process here in the root allowing it to open Sana he he ho my body. Letting that drop into the root. Getting to blow away anything that says otherwise, anything that says that you do not love your body, allowing that to just be released from the root chakra. And just shake it away. Releasing anything that says being in the body is hard. Or being in the body means that I need to be in pain. towards the body. Just stirring that root chakra up, letting go here. any unconscious energy there in that root chakra that says, gosh, I can't be in my body. It's too hard. Ooh. Anything that keeps you from being fully rooted in yourself. into that sacral chakra, into the low belly. Here we have emotional programs of shame and guilt about our sexuality in our body, about gender, about how we look in our body, anywhere where we've been shamed for showing off our body, we hold that here in the sacral chakra. And so feel into that. See if you may be holding any of that energy there and let's choose in this moment as you breathe into that to allow that to begin to unwind there's nothing to be ashamed of there's no need to be ashamed of your physical form
some healing light into the reproductive organs here in the sacral chakra. acceptance and gratitude. love here. into the solar plexus so much is held here feeling into the area near the diaphragm where we hold on to so much judgment we are literally told to suck it in <laughs> to pull in here allow the belly to relax allow the breath to relax the belly bringing maybe even a hand to the belly feeling into that connection there Nai, nai, ho, ta, hey, hey. This is where our light lives. Anu, nai, ho, our personal power. Ahu. But so often we are relegated to the corner here. We are shoved inward. We are told to make our light smaller. Nahu, nai, ka, hey, ho, my. Releasing any sadness that that may bring. Opening up the solar plexus. Like a big bright sun. Coaxing that energy center open. is okay. Releasing comparison and judgment. with your body. Maybe it doesn't look the way you want it to look. Letting that go. Ah,
releasing anything that you can't digest from the outside world, anything that's stuck here in the solar plexus, anything anyone said to you that has harmed your view of your body, letting that go, breathing into that and releasing that big inhale. Exhale. Big inhale. Exhale. place of any sadness that may exist here about how you have treated your body and about how other people have treated your body oh clearing any separation between you and your body anywhere where you have lack of trust oh our lack of trust in our body mirrors the lack of trust in the masculine around us because our body is a masculine element of us Oh, Anai, Nahe, Anota, Hey, Ahota, Nahe, Nahe, oh, Nahe, oh, Gawapai, Nahui, who battled. experience in your body matters. process going in the body and bringing the light into the heart here allowing and asking for support calling in your team your ancestral lineage here to begin to support you in healing your physical form from the inside out To your throat chakra. And the throat is where we hold so many of the stories we speak and we tell about our body. So much judgment here in the throat. <laughs> Opening up, ah, letting that just start to pour out of your physical form from that throat chakra all the way down to the earth. 
some energy of clarity, clarity of words about how you speak about yourself, how you speak to yourself. Ooh, beginning to clear any programs here in the throat chakra from your childhood, any speech, any negative self-talk that has been present since you were little. choices in your words. Ooh. Erasing any damage done here from anybody else's words that you've received. Our throat chakra is not just about speaking, it's about listening as well. into that throat. our mental body where we hold on to projection, illusion, false sense of self, false body image, false talk. Another place where we hold on to stories from others, where we hold on to visions of what we maybe once looked like and try to get back to all the time, not accepting and loving who we are in this moment. Bringing light into that third eye. Hey, 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 oh, hey, 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 oh, 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 Go home, opening up our perspective. Go my of what it means to love and be in love with our being, our body. Engo hu sahe na kau mai amo hei ho na ho tai ho. up on social media. Oh, no. Anywhere where we're in an echo chamber of our own illusion and our own negative beliefs and feelings of our physical form. I, oh, oh, my, opening it up now. Open it. Open your perspective. 
about that bridge between our body and our soul and here in the crown we will be removing and releasing anything that keeps those two parts of us from speaking clearly to one another from working together in co-creation with one another anywhere where we're doing something to sabotage the body and the soul is telling us otherwise and we just feel like we can't change it those programs that run that keep us stuck in patterns, stuck in loops, stuck in places where we limit our physical form by what we put into it or how we choose not to take care of it. Those patterns, those sticky, sticky patterns. Breathing into the crown chakra, we open the crown chakra and allow violet light to pour into the crown. Ah, hey, ah, hey, oh. ah, hey. Bringing in light. Cobweb, cobwebs and false illusions here. Programs, limiters. perspective coming in here lots of source light just pouring from that crown all the way down to the root of you Ooh, having gratitude for your body
Breathing deeply. Feeling as that light passes from above your head all the way down through your body, this opening here, this joyous gratitude for being here in a physical form without this body, none of this life would be possible. Coming into deep gratitude for that. Feeling the gratitude of that. Good. Placing a hand on your heart, breathing into that space. Getting to move your fingers and toes and bringing some life and some movement back into that physical form. Perhaps as this journey comes to a close, you find yourself in some sort of position that feels comfortable to the body, stretching the body, moving the body here in some way, just honoring it. And over the coming days, paying special attention to any negative self-talk that tries to return and reprogramming, I love my body. My body is strong. My body is worthy. My body is valid. I love my body. I am grateful for my body. My body carries me. Thank you all so much for listening, for being here, for being a part of this community. I love you. Take care of those bodies. Enjoy it. And I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.